This is a new camera that's being offered by Banggood. It is a CMOS camera, but it's only 12 bucks, so I think it's worth having a look. The camera comes in this generic box, that's just for all FPV cameras. And in the box, you get the camera itself, a wire that unfortunately has PVC insulation, a metal bracket for mounting the camera, four screws to hold it to your frame or the bracket, and a set of generic instructions that don't even really apply to the camera. Now, the camera itself is a 1200 TV line CMOS camera. Um, I ordered it with a 2.5 millimeter lens, and you can get it with a 2.8 as well. The lens is actually really nice looking on it. The little hole here, it looks like it's for a microphone, but it's not. Uh, the camera only has a video output. There's no OSD, no audio either. The camera is powered by 5 to 12 volts, and as mentioned, it's a 1200 TV line CMOS. So I know that that will upset some people, but I don't think it's worth uh, writing off just yet. So let's, uh, let's cut to some flight footage. Alright, testing out this uh, cheap CMOS camera from Banggood. Uh, let's see how it performs. It's, uh, it's kind of cloudy today. The sun is out, so uh, it's, it's a good time for testing. Alright, let's get to it. Alright, here we go. Alright, so you can immediately see that the ground and the sky is all pretty well exposed. Uh, looking up at the sky, you can see the sun in the corner there. Back down at the ground, pretty quick. Uh, the image is nice and clear. And again, yeah, really well exposed. Right up at the sky, back down at the ground, up at the sky. Yeah, nice and quick. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> and this is why you always install a beeper. Alright, so, uh, colors were good. Image was nice and clear. Uh, the light to dark transition is pretty quick. Um, so, yeah, there's no reason to rule out a CMOS, and this one actually does a pretty good job. Alright, thanks for watching.